エジプトアレクサンドリアおよそ500万人が暮らす住宅が乱立する都市生涯をある探求に捧げた考古学者がいますパパコスタが探し求めているのは失われたアレクサンドロス大王の墓アレクサンドロスは世界征服に乗り出し1万 9,000 キロを遠征生ける神となりました古代の資料と現代の技術を組み合わせ大王の名を冠した都市の在りかをパパコスタが明らかにします発見された手がかりの数々ギリシャの財宝謎の地下道さらにはアレクサンドロス自身と思われる大理石でできた見事な像これらの手がかりによって迫りつつあるのは究極のゴールパピー、もしかしたら、私たちは、私たちの死を見つけたら、私たちの死を見つけたら、私たちの死を見つけたら、私たちの死を見つけたら、私たちの死を見つけたら、Founded by Alexander himself almost 2,300 years ago. National Geographic 協会の考古学者フレデリック・ヒーバートはこの20年さまざまな考古学的発見に立ち会ってきました。Pepe Papacosta is doing some very innovative excavations. She's finding lots of artifacts from the time of Alexander the Great. It's pretty exciting. パパコスタは世界の注目を浴びる大発見を成し遂げていますしかおよそ6メートルあたりの泥の中から女子たちはまばゆい大理石を見つけましたゾウを発見したニュースは瞬く間に世界に広がりギリシャの大統領は発掘現場を訪れましたアレクサンダーは私の理由で生きるようになりました。アレクサンダーは私の理由で生きるようになりました。私の理由で生きるようになりました。史上最も優れた軍事指揮官の一人と言われているアレクサンドロス大王。父であるマケドニアの王フィリッポス2世が暗殺されたため、二十歳で王位につきました。その後12年間軍を率いて1万 9,000 キロを遠征しエジプトからパキスタンに及ぶ大帝国を築きましたエジプトに侵攻したのは紀元前332年ここでファラオとなり神となったのですところが32歳の若さで死去バビロンでの死は今も謎に包まれています After he died, he was mummified. Buried in Memphis. Then, when the capital moved to the new capital of Alexandria, 
they dug Alexander up and they created a new tomb for him right in the center of ancient Alexandria. Then around 350 AD, the history of Alexandria starts to go silent. There's earthquakes, tsunamis, riots in the street. There are no more descriptions of this beautiful royal city. Alexander's tomb goes missing. The Hawaii 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 エジプトのどこに埋葬されたか手がかりを得ようとしています。しかし、どの文献も書かれたのは大王の死から数百年後です。We and also he describes that uh, Alexander was buried in the enclosure of uh, the royal quarter. ストラボンが記した古代都市は現代のアレクサンドリアの下にすっかり埋もれてしまっています。墓を探す前にまずは失われた都市を見つけなくてはなりません。アレクサンドリアは、ナイル川デルタの端に位置する地中海に面した都市。現在の広さはおよそ300平方キロメートル。マンハッタンのほぼ5倍です。通りの下にはアレクサンドロスが建てた古代都市が隠されています。It アメリカンフットボール場17個分ほどの広さを誇る公園。宅地化を免れた希少な場所に発掘現場はあります。シャララットガーデンズ エッフェル塔のほぼ倍の重さです。土の層には各時代の町の歴史が封じ込められています。掘り進めた地下9メートルまでを構成するのは現代。ビザンツ帝国時代、ローマ帝国時代。求めているのはギリシャ人の王たち
Yes, it's uh, very difficult, just to be honest, because of the huge quantity of debris and also the problem of water we have here. We have to pump continuously in order to be able to excavate here. Let's go to, to have a look from... Oh, Costa. We have this pump. Oh, good. Mabruk, I'm coming. Ah, you see, that. it's a, a handle, uh, an, an amphora handle. Very good. Can you clean it? Yes. First. Ah. Amphora to wa, liogawa ni totte ga tsuita wine nado o ireru tsubo desu. These uh, amphoras uh, used to come imported from Rhodes and Greek islands, bringing wine to Alexandria. It would have been at least a meter tall, right? Yes. That, that's a lot of wine. A good quality and of wine. And good huh? quality of wine. For sure, Alexandrians were very cheerful, very happy people. They used to drink a lot of wine. Okay. <laughs> you see the Greek letters it's on fantastic. it. We find the Greek names in the land of uh, Egypt. It's like a message in a bottle. Looks like you've dug right down to the very foundation of the city, the very streets that Alexander had walked in. この層の下は土と基盤岩、つまり最初の都市の土台です。大王自らが都市の詰めを引いたと言われています。Here it was built the first Alexandria we know. The city that was decreed by Alexander the Great himself. Exactly. コダイ都市のアリカを突き止めたパパコスタ。考古学者パパコスタとそのチームが地下水面の下を掘り続けています。絶えもなく湧き上がる水を吸い出すために24時間ポンプを動かし続けています。ウォー。ウォー。ウォー。ウォー。ウォー。ウォー。ウォー。
we are uncovering black stones. Even a small piece of a black stone is very important for the archaeology of Alexandria because we all know that black stones is the material that the Roman streets were made of. Fantastic. It's fantastic. Beautiful stones. The part we uncovered is about 25 meters. Can you imagine how many people uh, walked on this? How many chariots, how many horses? Everything happened in this street. We have to understand what is the relation between this uh, road with the rest of our uh, discoveries. Girisha Jidai no Michi no Ue ni tsukurare ta kanou sei mo. 重要な歴史的資料である古代都市の計画を見直します。This map was made by the Egyptian astronomer Mahmoud Bey El Falaki in 1866. At that time, the streets and a lot of buildings, ancient buildings, were obvious. 地図によると、町には二本の大通りがありました。幅30メートルほどもある東西を貫くカノピックウェイその通りと交差するのは南北に走る R1 This is a satellite map of modern Alexandria and we are exactly here these are the Salalat Gardens We made a transparency version of the map of Mahmoud Bay 海岸線を揃えるように地図を重ね合わせます When we line the old map with the modern one the result for me is fantastic We see clearly that uh, the crossroads of the two broad streets of ancient Alexandria uh, are very close to the area we are excavating ストラボンの記録によるとアレクサンドロス大王の墓がある王家の居住区はこの交差点の北側となりますそしてシャララートガーデンは交差点から数メートルにあることが分かりました I believe that the, the road we uncovered is the first parallel road to the main canopic street パパコスタたちが発見した道 L2 は公園の北側を走っていますパピーズ・ロード is a game changer in the study of Alexandria because Pepe has actually found one of the main roads described by Strabo. That puts the whole description of classical Alexandria in a frame of reference where we can now say we are sitting in the royal quarters of Alexandria. The city of Alexandria has been built by the city of Alexandria. 古代都市アレクサンドリアを明らかにしついには王家の居住区も特定しましたアレクサンドロス大王の墓は居住区にあると彼女は信じていますそれだけではありません大王の死後帝国は分割され統治されましたエジプトのファラオとなったのはプトレマイオスプトレマイオス王朝を275年にわたり支配した10人以上もの王たちどの王もアレクサンドロス大王の近くに埋葬されることを望みました来世のために神の近くにいたかったのです Inside of Strabo's royal precinct is a literal valley of the kings Not a single Ptolemaic king has been found yet The tomb of Alexander is the holy grail of archaeology. It's the dream of all the archaeologists of the world. The tomb of Alexander is the holy grail of archaeology. It's the dream of all the archaeologists of the world. The tomb of Alexander is the holy grail of archaeology. It's the dream of all the archaeologists of the world. The tomb of Alexander is the holy grail of archaeology. 古代文献によるとアレクサンドロス大王は最後のファラオたちに囲まれて埋葬されています
I'm very happy because I believe that there are a lot of possibilities that we are in the right side. Papa Costa は12万平方メートルのシャララートガーデンの発掘を独占的に許可されましたが、一大事業です。An archaeologist needs a lifetime to dig at Shalalat Gardens. We need the support of uh, technology. National Geographic is going to support us and help us to use new technology. Hitekou Tomography to yobarelu, Sai Sentan no Gijutsu o Mochita Butsri Tansa Ho de, Koen no Chika ni, Nani ga umorete iru ka o Kuashiku Shirabe mas. Tsugi no Hakkuts Chiten o Kimeru Tedaske ni Suru Tame des. 公園一帯にケーブルを敷き、地中へ電流を流して電気抵抗を測定します。何百箇所も測定し、地中の電気抵抗の分布をデジタルマップに書き出すのです。抵抗の小さい場所は砂や土であるのに対し、抵抗が大きい場所は岩や建築物の一部、あるいは墓の可能性も。In the end, we can have an idea. If it is big, if it is small, how how deep it is. 専門チームは10日かけて調査を完了させます。Lucan's Pharsalia is the only detailed description of Alexander's tomb that survives from the ancient world. A visit by Julius Caesar. In eager haste, he went down into the grotto, hewn out for a tomb. There lies the mad son of Philip of Pella. Alexander. So his tomb was likely to have a subterranean chamber to maintain a cool and constant temperature all year. So we're now entering the great tomb of Kamushukafa. It really is incredible here. Alexandros Dayo ya, Chikakuni Maiso Sareta Farao no Hakao image Srutameni, Katakombe to Yobare Chikano Boche at the Kimashita. You imagine what it was like when they carried their dead down here. It's at least 60 feet down. I can't imagine trying to bring a body down here. 考古学者マリアニルソンが案内しているのは、かつてここに暮らしていたギリシャ人たちの共同墓地。地下に佇む死者の町です。It reminds very much of a Greek temple, doesn't it? It really does. Typical for Alexandria, uh, the, these rock-cut tombs. So here you have some great examples of how Egyptian art meets the newcomers. Here on the frieze you've got the winged sun disk, which is traditional for Egyptian art. But if we enter a little bit closer, here, you can clearly see the Greek elements. Yes, the Medusa. Uh -huh. Incredible. So, let's now enter into the main sanctuary wow. itself. And we've got a unique scene. Well, it looks like a traditional mummification scene. Indeed. Yes. What we have here is a depiction of Osiris which is a representation of the dead himself, yes. of course. You got Anubis, who is performing the mummification. And to just support the entire mummification process, you got the canopic jars. Oh, they would put the kidneys and the indeed, liver. Indeed, and, yes. indeed. Rekishka Quintus Curtius Rufus wa Alexandros Dayo mo Egypto no Pharao no yo ni Mira ni sareta to kaki nokoshite imasu. It's not Alexander the Great's tomb, but surely his tomb must share some connections with this type of tomb. Subterranean, carved with a number of different styles. Something like it, yes. I'm certain that he would have included elements of the Egyptian culture too. We know from the sources that there was a main chamber in which Alexander was placed in a sarcophagus. This is the legacy, putting Egyptian and Greek art together. This is the legacy of it Alexander is. the Great. It yes. is. 
このカタコンベのように地下道が入り組んだ地中の迷宮のような場所にアレクサンドロス大王の墓はあるのかもしれませんシャララートガーデンではパパコスタのチームが地表の下に何か見つけたようです。We just found this construction and we realized that there is a tunnel inside. It is interesting to, to have a look. Oh. It's man made. Oh, very interesting. I would like to be inside. But、uh, I forgot my bathing suit. Oh my god, new adventures in this excavation. We have to go inside, but it's very difficult. We will ask for volunteers, I think. We don't know how long it is, how deep it is, so it's better to have some、uh, precautions. And Ramadan, if you feel afraid, you come out. Okay? Be careful. Please. Maybe it、uh, leads to something、uh, else, something interesting. We'll see. わずかな空間しか息をする場所はありません。地下道の上に積み重なる何百トンもの土砂がいつ崩れるともわかりません。You have to speak to us to talk to us. Everything okay? I wish it could lead to a secret door, to a chamber. It's very long. It stops or it goes on. ーメートル近く進んだところで問題発生地下道は崩れ落ちていましたリゼロトフデブリ地下道を塞ぐ瓦礫の山のあちらこちらに謎の焦げ跡が焼けたロープの一部もあります It's not safe to excavate it more due to the tons of soil,、uh, the street, and also a huge modern building. 12年間ここを発掘してきたパパコスタにはもどかしい交代です。Very difficult day. But uh, I'm not uh, ready to say that、uh, there is nothing here or is something big. I'm optimist. We keep going. I cannot stop. I have to go on. Alexander wasn't born with the title great, but he had a strong lineage. He was the son of a powerful king. Philip II of Macedon. Philip was buried in a town called Verhina with incredible finds. I mean, this is one of the most amazing archaeological finds of the 1970s. His skeleton was found in an opulent golden coffin. There were wreaths made out of solid gold, simply masterpieces of art. 
If these stunning items were found in his father's tomb, what might Alexander's own burial hold? Papa Costa was the Buzli Tansa team from Shararato Garden. The report shows about 14 anomalies, that means archaeological targets. Out of the 14 points that the geophysical survey suggested, I decided to start from the biggest one. Uh, we call it E3B. E3B to nazukerare ta chiten wa genzai no hakutsu genba kara 250 meter hodo no basho. Hakutsu team o wari ateru mae ni jizen no chousa ga hitsuyo desu. The next step would be drillings in order to be sure that the suggested points were correct. This is the National Geographic Borescope. We're going to put it down into one of the boreholes here so we will have a chance to look down inside at what Papi is finding. It's a very fine, high-resolution camera on a long fiber optic. It's actually developed to inspect 747 airplane engines, and our engineers have adapted it for archaeological investigation. It has this incredible robotic end here that can look in every direction. We'll start looking around. Okay. Uh, can you go up? You want up? And go to the side uh, here. There are white uh, signs right. of limestone, but I'm not sure if it is it's a construction or small uh, random stones. This area we can look around and, and have a pretty good idea that there's stones down there, but it's not enough, is it? No, of course, we have to excavate. Absolutely. But uh, for sure, we know that we have to dig here. Moto no basho mo sono mama hakutsu o tsuzuke. This is actually a culmination of Pepe's obsession here in Alexandria. She started nearly 23 years ago, and here we are in the royal quarter of the city of Alexandria 2,300 years ago. She knows that. She has X marks the spot with a Roman road right in her other excavations. We know she's going to find something. We don't know what it is. Papa Costa が探し求めているのは失われたアレクサンドロス大王の墓。古代都市アレクサンドリアで王家の居住区があった場所を特定しました。メインの発掘地点と並行して250メートルほど東の E3B で別のチームが発掘を始めます。Ah, bravo. Good. See, it's a plaster, but ah, there is ah, color. Ah, let's see. Beautiful. See. Blue, yes. red, yes. Great, great. Yeah. This is the type of the Macedonian tombs decoration. This you know that. Great. プラスターに塗られた青は世界最古の人工合成顔料と考えられています。主成分はカルシウム同系酸塩。この顔料は大王の父親の墓にも使われています。It is interesting because we find a lot of small things, of course. Yes. Oh, give it to me. Oh. Uh, Ibrahim, can oh. you bring uh, more marble? This is white this marble. This is real marble. Uh, Greek white marble. 
Well, it's really unusual to see this here in Egypt, especially in the delta of the Nile. There's no stone and there's especially no Aegean uh, marble like this. Very uh, rare to find a Greek marble, a white marble in Alexandria. Yes. So yes. It's uh, just a good sign, just it's a great, an encouraging uh, sign. Great sign. オークの人員を投入しても400トンもの土砂や泥を取り除くには何週間もかかります。その間ヒーバートは一度アメリカへ戻ります。it is beginning of December, so the, the weather is getting worse now. Most of the time, this is a problem for us because it can create a danger. Soil can collapse, workers can uh, sleep on the soil, so it's not easy to work under the rain. But uh, we wait the rain to stop and we continue. The work was very difficult this time because we had to fight with uh, water above and water below. We went very deep. The soil is very uh, fragile and uh, I was afraid that it could uh, collapse and also the water level, that is always a problem. This anomaly could be many things. Could be a building, could be a monument, could be even a tomb. I feel excited, but also very nervous. Maybe it will be something great, maybe it will be nothing. Egypt to Nimodo Tekta Hibato, Hakuts Chiten, E three B O Mesasimas. Genzai no Toshino Chihio Kara, Hachimetor Hodo Chikani are Kozo Buts no Shotai Ga Kasare Made, Ato Vazuka. Come back. It's great to see you. Nice to see you. My goodness, look at this. Yes, it's a hard work this time. Wow, Pepe, so huge. Yeah. How deep are you now? 23 feet, 25 feet, yeah. feet yes. Uh, Pepe, it's an Pepe. enormous amount of work. Most uh, difficult thing, issue is the water level, as all the time. As always, yeah. As always. It's going to be very exciting to see what's underneath there. Should we go take a look? Yes, of course. Great. Look at this. Finally, we can see the bottom of this incredible trench. Yeah. which is the natural bedrock of Alexandria. So that's the natural bedrock of Alexandria? Exactly. Wow. But there is a human activity here. This is a constructed layer, right, Pepe? It is, exactly. It is uh, constructed. Butsuri Tansa de Kenchi Sareta Ijo Tai wa Papa Costa ga kitai shiteita chikado ya boshitsu dewa arimasen deshita. What do you think it is, Pepe? Uh, according to my opinion, this should be a kind of a defensive uh, ditch for the Islamic walls of uh, East Alexandria. Incredible, incredible. So the city of Alexandria, founded by Alexander the Great, 
has changed and changed through the centuries. And here it's clear, a thousand years later, they dug a giant moat to go around another wall of the city. この辺りではプトレマイオス朝時代の層は失われていました王家の居住区跡は後世の住民たちが町を作り変えていくうちに壊されてしまったようです I hoped of course that it was something different a construction or another material Do you still believe that the tomb of Alexander the Great is here? The only logical place to be buried at that time was in this area. Hakkut Chiten E3 B からは待望のアレクサンドロス大王の墓は発掘されませんでした。一方、250メートルほど西のメインの地点でも発掘が進められています。現在の都市の地表から10メートルほど掘ったところで、パパコスタは驚きの発見を成し遂げていました。So uh, wow. you see these uh, big stones? They're massive. Yes. We took out two of them, something very difficult, and we realized that under there is nothing more. It's the bedrock of Alexandria. Let me uh, show you how big this uh, foundation is. It's a uh, huge, all wow. this line. keeps going and going and going. Do you have any idea, thought, how much further it's going to go? We are about 200 feet, more or less, without arriving to the end. Of a so, single building? Yes, and it goes on. Yeah. Clearly, these are very large foundation stones for what would have been a very large building. What do you think it was? Yes, this is a good question. In the royal quarter, they were the most important public buildings of Alexandria. So, I'm sure that this building should be one of these famous buildings of the past. ヨダイナキソ部分を目安に壮大なギリシャ建築の姿を再現しました。真っ白な大理石と石灰岩で作られた建物は神殿や王宮や墓とともに王家の居住区に立っていたのでしょう。古代アレクサンドリアは素晴